Hello family, this is Gamers Forum back with another interesting video on Clash of Kings. So guys, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe it on because this channel is fully focused on tips and tricks regarding Clash of Kings. You'll get all the necessary data and details over each and every event over this channel. So guys, in today's video, we are going to talk about the Night Hall, guys. Basically, I have uh, got a lot of members asking that how people score uh, the maximum points in the Night Hall in the different stages that is being uh, distributed all over the week. So in today's video, we are going to discuss about that thing and I will talk about the benefits of the different levels and the rankings. As you can see, I am at blessed, blessed night plus two rank, which is the top most rank at this particular period uh, in uh, whether it is of in server or the out server. The maximum ranking is blessed night plus two only. As you can see, let me show you the all server ranking. You can see the top most ranking again, blessed night plus two and normal ranking also it is the best one means it is really cool for what uh, how you can achieve that one uh, we are going to talk about that one also so the first thing let's start from the beginning we know that there are different stages out there first one is the warm-up training it is some of the tasks that is uh, being regarding the nyan beast hit and some of the uh, hitting the monsters and like that those tasks are very much easy in the rally training the second phase it is also quite easy because all you have to do is just to try to beat the level 5 of the campsite and you will open all the chest just from one complete rally which is being successful guys so that is also easy in the third cultural training a quiz regarding clash of kings and the latest event and your basic knowledge about clash of kings is being tested in this particular thing if you have a quite better knowledge about the clash of kings you can easily open all the reward chest and try to uh, answer all the 15 out of 15 questions guys that is all about the three basic days which is being very easily can be completed by 100 percent guys now let's come to the next four because these four are the only one that is being deciding that you are able to achieve in the top rankers in the kingdom or not guys so for that one guys there are different level first one is the infantry second is the cavalry third archer and siege guys when we talk about the infantry the basic thing that i must recommend is that you should go with a particular hero which is being focused on the infantry means each day whatever it is whether it is infantry cavalry archers or siege the best thing that you can do is that just switch all the lord skill to the particular troop that is being at that particular state means if i am uh, talking about the infantry i will switch all my lord skill to the infantry to get the maximum of the attribute bonus apart from this i will use certain number of the uh, best of the best infantry hero with the best equipment set guys if we talk about the infantry training my recommendation will be try to use the gladiator set on your particular uh, wasteland warrior it is the best one and it will easily get uh, give you around uh, 1100 percent of the attack and defense that is very cool and it is really appreciating and very much beneficial at this particular one because if you go with that particular one with the 1100 percent it is quite very easy for you to gain a easy win over the opponent guys well that is all about the infantry if we call about the cavalry you have different of the uh, uh, heroes that is being promoting the infantry you can uh, you can visit out the heroes out here for the inf uh, cavalry i must recommend you can go with the zhao yun or you can go with the particular death knight because these two are being focused on the cavalry stats use the best of the best equipments regarding the cavalry increment and use it and you will definitely going to achieve out the maximum number of stats that can be a minimum of 1300 percent if you do it correctly and if you have a good science research and everything that is being focused on that one guys now let's move to the third one guys if we talk about the archer training again you have to move with the archer hero guys whenever we are going to talk about the archer hero the two names that used to strike in my mind is first one is the love the god of love the arrow of god of love this particular one is very much cool hero and very much appreciating for the archer stats apart from this there is one more hero uh, which is the particular 
win ranger it is also a focused archer focused hero and you can use this one at that particular certain order and if we talk about the equipment for the archer hero the best of the best equipment suggestion for the archers is the complete archangel gold set guys you can trust it because it is going to help you a lot for the archer increment in the stats guys so this is about the one and if we talk about the siege you have to go with the siege hero and when we, wherever we are going to talk about siege hero the hero that is being at here is the commanding at siege it's war song master it is very cool hero and you can easily upgrade or get it unlocked with the various manners guys well, well if you talk about that one what equipment you should use on the siege hero you can uh, again trust out the archangel complete set because it is the best for the siege hero uh, increment guys so if uh, you might be thinking that why i'm saying that to use particular hero guys if you don't have stats in a particular hero which is very much uh, cool or very much uh, um, appreciating and very much destructive as you can see my particular main hero is already having a, everything 1200 plus uh, infantry cavalry and archers everything is good at this particular one my main hero so i don't have to switch to the different hero to gain access or get additional of the attribute bonus but if you don't have that much strong hero then the only way of getting the maximum points is switching out to the specific hero for that particular increment of the stats guys so keep that in mind and now let's move to the next thing that is very important guys whenever you are joining each of these four trainings whether it is infantry cavalry archer and siege try to join with the group guys you can make your particular group you can invite your friends which have supportive uh, attribute which are just focused like you guys so collect a bunch of good soldiers or players and then join out guys because random players can be weak can be equal or can be stronger we cannot judge them because it is a random so random can be anything uh, su uh, surprising but if you go with your team you will have always have a benefit at upper hand that you will definitely get something which is being supportive for you and get the maximum points for the victory we know that the maximum points for the victory is 180 points if you go with the three of the three wins if you go with three uh, two wins and one loss it will be giving you the mvp 150 points and like that it all goes with the certain order guys so this is how you have to play this particular week of the night event guys the particular uh, redemption store is being very cool and the thing is that whatever ranking will be you will definitely get something for free daily purpose guys as you can see for my particular ranking it is giving me all these stuff for free at the daily purpose guys so it is very cool and the best thing about this one is that you have to just spend some of the minutes from your side daily and you will get certain of the day and apart from that there is a big store of the honor store which can you redeem for various of the item the best of the best thing about this particular store is that you can get a huge number of fine iron chest uh griffin stone chest a uh, research stone chest and the one hour speed chest. these are the best of the best thing that you can redeem from the honor store guys and there is another main thing is that this particular honor store keep on refreshing on the daily basis means you can compare you can collect the same amount every day so this is all the benefit of this one and if you go with this one in a particular row or order as mentioned by me guys you will definitely going to achieve everything in the particular order and you will add the top list of rankings at your particular current server guys as you can see at my current server i am holding at the top uh, 11th position because i am having the same uh, count or uh, and the level uh, night level and the count of the points in my last week so that's why it is being collage and at to draw at the three different positions out here guys so that's all about the night hall guys i hope that i have told you everything that is being helpful for you please implement the same thing as mentioned and i will be back with another video as soon as possible guys and guys if you find the video information useful please hit the like and subscribe button for sure i will be back with another video as soon as possible till then keep growing with gamers forum thank you guys